Hello Capricorn, thank you for stopping by. This is Elizabeth. I just want to um, say thank you for those stopping by today and um, whoever new to this message as well. And I hope your week went well, happy, healthy, abundant as always. Um, just want to say thank you to those who um, comment, like, share and describe to my channel so other can see my message so I can also connect it to you as well and also helping my excuse me small channel grow as well too so today I'm going to look into your message for this coming week please take in what resonate and leave the rest I'm going to look into your message now all right so know that uh, the cards are already been blessed and shuffled just waiting for the first message to come through for you here all right uh, we received the message on the three of michael this is three of sword some kind of um, you know um, healing wound release the past coming forward into the um, current moment we have the perspective this is a, um, a better way to look at things, so sometimes pausing if you need to do so. Also coming, the next message is a sun for the outcome and in the near future. So let's take a look into the message together. So the first message is letting us know that this is a three of Michael, so this is uh, considered as a three of swords, and um, letting you know that uh, maybe you are disappointed on something uh, heartbroken or being in a painful moment or some kind of source or certain situation here. But the, um, the message is telling you here that uh, there's an angel to comfort you and you know this is time to release the past. Let the past be the past and pick up the moment and move forward with your journey. Or you will grow from this situation. The whatever is teaching you is the lesson learned. Uh, whatever that apply to you there. Okay, so this is time to heal on wound. Time heals on wound. Release the past and let go and learn from whatever that happened and move forward to the current moment. In the current situation, we have a perspective, okay? So it is a better way to do things sometimes. Sometimes when things does not go your way or you could not find a solution or the answer, it, it's okay for you to pause and freeze the situation until you can come to the conclusion. Go within and do a deep thinking, see? If there is a better way to solve this, a better way to come up with the answer, it's a better way to fix things as well. You know, when you pause, if you pause for reflection and insight, not just pause for no reason, okay? So you will definitely have that answer for it. So it is okay to take your time. It's better than uh, take your time pause and freeze your situation and your decision instead of giving the decision where it's going to hurt you in the long run okay so now after you go all of this heartbreak and freezing here in the near future you have the sun you see that it's a growing it's a new reset the new beginning the new dawn the new start again so life is wonderful moving forward and you will thrive to the power of being thinking positive, thinking of uh, manif uh, positive manifestations, and you hang it in there, give you a new, um, new dawn. You are going to uh, bloom just like this beautiful sunflower here with the pathway of the sun will shine the uh, bright light on you how to take that path. You can see that clearly. And overall, you become the uh, come out your inner child again. You are not sad or angry, or um, 
or ignore anymore. You have the energies of uh, a child within you and you laugh, you smile because now your uh, beginnings are coming. You can see the light, you can see the light in the end of the tunnel. Okay, so this is an inspiring success of your new day and your new beginning as well. Let's look into the tarot uh, message. Tarot message on the first card, it said three of swords. Look at that. You have a very, very hard broken because you have a three of swords here and then you have three of swords there as well. So now make sure that you really, really, really release the past and you will grow from the situation. Take the situation, be a lesson learned, okay? So know this time heals on wound. Let go of the past, leave your current moment. Only time that you can look in the past is to see how far you have come. Make sure you really do because you have two of, uh, three of swords there. Moving forward in the recent, uh, recent past here, you have energies of high priestess. You know all the, the tool, the key to solve and to come up and with the idea what you need to fix. You have that intuition within you. Even you see here the, the, uh, the moon here. Even though the energy is telling you that the moon symbol, even though you don't see things clearly, things are work behind the scene, it doesn't mean that you don't see, that you don't believe. The thing is, when you believe, you'll see, okay? Stay within your own intuition and believe that things uh, will come to the solution for you. The light will shine on you. Things will be okay. Believe and you will see. In the current moment here, I can see that you have energies of fire of sword. You actually have to battle and fight to get to where you are right now. And stay your ground. Send a clear message that you are going to combat. You are going to be ready. Whatever comes your way, you are going to to fight it, you are going to win that. Right now, you are winning situation. You are winning mode, okay? You have three sort of your own, and this um, individual here, they they bow their head for you. They, they left their sword, they walk away. You are winning, okay? All right? So, make sure you send clear message. In the near future, the outcome, you seem you want to go for a searching for your meaning of life. You leave your comfortable and familiar place to go and search for more. You still need more and need to find out what out there for you. So we'll clarify what are you are searching for, what you go after. Let's clarify the um, Three of Sword. The energy clarification of Three of Sword is uh, Six of Cup. Why well, have you a heart broken with love? You have two heart broken. Okay? Love. Broken, heart broken related to love. Perhaps someone walk out on you or you walk out on them. Perhaps love situation didn't go well, caused you a heartache, thrumping, and pain. But notice who is coming here. The own love is want to return. Um, they want to be in your life again. Perhaps you're thinking back. The own love that you used to be now is want to return to you. Okay? So they are offering you a cup of flower, a cup of gift. Would you accept the apology and move forward? See, they come up with a gift here. The flower, bouquet of flower, if you have your choice to accept that or not, okay? The choice is yours. You don't have to be heartbroken anymore. The person or the love, it's return and want to return, okay? Of, offer the apology here, okay? A gift, a love. Let's clarify the, uh, look at that, my goodness. We were talking about this, the energies 
asking me to tell you that. Remember the high priestess? I was talking to you about you have your own intuition. The moon there, you see that? Here's the moon. Even though you don't see things clearly, you don't know things going to move in your favor, you don't have to worry about that because usually most of the time the, the power of the higher source working behind the scene. Remember I talked earlier, now even though you don't see it, you don't see things clearly, things work behind the scene, uh, it will be your uh, a blessing, okay? It will come for you. You believe it, you will see it, okay? I mentioned it again. This is what the Spirit was telling me, that even though you don't see things clear, there's a moon, double moon is coming from the high priestess and the moon itself. So believe in the process. And even though you don't see, believe it. And things work behind the scene and it will come for you. Believe and you will see. Let's take a look and clarification of the... Uh, Fire of Sword here. You see here Capricorn. Make sure you send a message loud and clear that you are not going to be under the restriction, under the spell, under the this um, person who put the power over you, okay? You don't have a delusion anymore. You need to see clearly, get yourself out from this uh, restrictive and change in, in your neck, okay? Perhaps you some kind of addiction, could be, you know, addiction of many things, making sure you get rid of that energy, okay? You need to send message loud and clear that you are not going to be under spell of any sorts anymore. You have power to do this, Capricorn. You need to get out of that, okay? All right, so let's clarify the uh, Eight of Cup here, why you want to go search out for more. You have energies of... Uh, the uh, em, uh, not emperor, the uh, empress, emperor. Uh, let's see, I get the card mixed it up here. So now, in order for you to go out to looking for your own uh, pathway of life here, you walk away because you want to find more true, more source. If you stay in your truth and your belief, it will lead you there, okay? So you see the, um, the golden crown on this uh, individual here, high priest here. And uh, if you believe in your own intellectual and believe and follow the rule, follow the, you believe and you will walk your way to the truth. And uh, you can see that you, uh, you know, you have all the tools, all the, all the knowledge, all of uh, uh, holy knowledge that can guide you to where it need to be going there. Because overall, you're honing the priest, the higher source, the higher knowledge, you're honing the keys, okay? So it will lead you there. Can you imagine the uh, high priestess and uh, that come together there? So I am stucking on the energies of where the, um, the energies of that uh, priest there. I am just could not come up with a name, okay? It's a hierophant. I could try to think and think for some reason. I am just half a blank, okay? The high priestess and hierophant come together in your aid to help you get out of this restrictive, okay? You have your own intuition, you have your own belief, and um, even though, look, you, you don't see things clearly. These two individuals, uh, high priestess and higher offense, so shine the light on you and give you the, uh, the pathway to go through and the heartache as well. You have things and, and uh, energy to fix it, okay? So you have that uh, power within you. You see here, you have the sun. 
the sun is guarantee you of the new dawn beginning the new reset okay so it's going to be blooming uh, sunshine again okay so at the bottom of the deck see look at that you have the um, the fool the child of a divine itself have a belief going to go on a journey new beginning starting for you trust and believe in your own intuition and energies of high offense and high priestess okay and you will certainly on your way to your uh, success and your own comfort let's just take a look into the message for the oracle here so the first message is coming out for you as a ascending the mountain keep going forward capricorn no matter how broken disappointment and you don't see things clearly or you are under restrictive spell of something you know keep pushing forward up to the high mountain you know some spot might be beautiful in flowers some spot might be just a rock some spot might be just a thorn i mean keep going i mean the successful journey of life is never um, be smooth you know you at certain patch you see certain things but if you keep going you will finally see the the sun over here okay the new beginning right there is promising in the near future for you keep going keep moving keep pushing along you'll get to where you need to be you get to your finish line and you'll be glad that you did not quit Take a look in here, see, a passion and pleasure save you your life, see, your hard work will pay off. You will be celebrating with your friend, family, and your community, and, uh, you know, you're glad that you keep forward, your know, hard work pay off. You will certainly enjoy your, your journey, um, the, you know, the blessing is yours. Moving forward with the... Uh, uh, near future a message is rainbow blessing blessing are showering your life see it's guaranteed to to keep your life a showering of uh, abundant success when the sun come toward your energy it's going to be life wonderful you know thrive to the power of being positive pushing forward inspiring success see the journey of the fool the beginning it's going to have a successful ending because as you see how the rainbow blessing coming to you you see the sun shine bright down here everything is going to shine the light on your pathway so you can see the pathway to walk to your finish line you'll be success okay the sun also promising you the journey of the fool the child of the advisor traveling with the the light guiding your pathway because you are uh, a son of uh, and daughter of the divine guidance and you know your rainbow blessing is yours and a lot of emotion a lot of new beginning and success blessing coming your way so let's see you do have a heartbroken twice here and uh, really sadness and um, you do have a, a new love our own love coming to your life and some point and you or them walking away so let's see the message from them shall we the first message is damage we are both hurting from this situation any broken up but love is always hurt and painful but let's see the clarification on those missed opportunity I didn't act when I should have they missed it but that's why they're coming back see their own love is return okay and offering the apologies and making things better time i'm afraid it's too late to take action so let's just see the clarification of the card here a damage we are both uh, hurting from this i don't feel ready and that is why they pose and pull on and see and one more message from clarification oh my goodness i missed opportunity i didn't act when i should have so they are messing up here 
Capricorn. So they realize they're messing up. That's why. Okay. They did not take an action when you warn them or ask them to. But they're coming back here. Okay. They walk away. They want to come back to you. They leave you heartbroken, of course. Very heartbroken. Let's just see here. Tom, I'm afraid it's too late to take action. I'm planning on calling you soon. Hear that? They want to come to towards you. Tom, I'm afraid it's too late to take action. I am planning on calling you soon. See, this is clarification. See, that's why I see this. They want to come back. They want to return. Your own love want to offer the apology return back to your life. This is amazing message for you. Um, I can see that it would make you happy if you are waiting for your love to return. <clears throat> your own love, the person you manifest, the person you have in mind coming back to you. All right, so your message, oh my goodness, it's partner again. So you do have partner coming back right there. And what else? This partner need to restrict from the <clears throat> under spell of some sort. This is partner. You know, either life partner or the career partner. It say to you here, Capricorn, say, Dear Capricorn, allow helpful, supportive partnership into your personal life and career. <clears throat> and both parties benefit as a result. You are receiving help from heaven and from a person who being needed skills and resources. See, the partner, you need a partner. Partners are coming back. Uh, personal life partner and career partner as well. So in turn, both parties will benefit from the result. That is message for you for this coming week, Capricorn. Uh, I hope it resonates. If you like the video, please click like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. As I mentioned earlier, before then, take care, Capricorn.